we all want to think that our kids are not looking at porn and I, I perfectly understand that desire to think not my kid. What we know from study after study without question, if you have a son then you should assume, especially by the age of around 13 or 14, that he has looked at porn. Whether he has chosen to look at porn or it has come at him through Pornhub, Snapchat, Instagram. And I think what a lot of people don't get is that mainstream is hardcore. We were recently in a classroom with a group of seventh graders and the question that all the boys had was, is it true that girls really like to be tied up? The reason we think about pornography and hypersexualized media as a public health crisis is that it is not an individual problem. It is a societal problem. Asking a parent to prevent their kid from seeing porn is like asking a parent to prevent their kid from breathing polluted air. It's just not possible given how pervasive hypersexualized media and pornography are today. What we know from studies and from speaking to young people is that pornography has now become the major form of sex ed in the Western world. Another thing that the, the porn culture is teaching them is um, that aggressive forms of sexual behavior towards girls and women is completely normal. Like it's not criminal, it's not even problematic. As a parent, you're constantly looking for valuable resources that are going to help you do the best you can for your kids. And that is absolutely what I found with Culture Framed. I was impressed by the parent program and the continued research that the organization is doing. It is fully comprehensive. It really takes you from the point of education, with then, which then gives you a sense of urgency that you've got to have this conversation with your kids, and then guides you through uh, that conversation. Culture Reframed is designed to empower parents with knowledge and then to give them the tools they need to not only teach their own children this important information, but to make sure that their children then create a circle of knowledge with their friends and that the parents speak to each other and create a community of understanding and awareness because that's how change happens.